Make it quick. Make yourself useful. Times change, and so must the Zandalari. We have only a few moments alone. There are things about my kingdom that you must know. Zandala is beset by enemies, both within and without. This is why I went seeking the Horde, and why I call upon you, one of its greatest heroes. Blood trolls surge across our northern border. They drag our people off to the swamps of Nazmia, never to be seen again. Meanwhile, there's an Chuli council. Ugh. Scheming politicians and decrepit old tusks dismisses this threat. They convince my father that nothing need be done. Princess. When you left, you told your father you were going exploring, not negotiating with mongrels from the Horde. You are sworn to protect this kingdom. If you will not do your duty, then I must look for someone who will. The best way to protect the kingdom would be for me to banish this thing to Baudun. The Horde has no place in Zandala. Their fate will not be decided by you, General. Nor you. Your father is displeased that you have brought these creatures here. He has ordered me to collect you. I fight to protect those who cannot protect themselves. My king, the horde has only come to steal our navy for their Undead war chief. This champion defied the might of Stormwind to save Zul and me. Such bravery merits an audience, father. Enough! I will decide what to do with this outsider. Jacrazet speaks true. You seek our fleet's might against the Alliance. But my daughter is right as well. Rescuing her showed great courage. A trait I admire. Kalanji worries that I do not see our true enemies. Know that I am not as blind as she fears. Let us see if the Horde can prove its worth to Zandala. Let them stay in the Great Seal as my guests. For now, only the Zandalari may walk those sacred halls. The law steals. The law is what I say it is. For so long as I am king, the eyes of the kingdom rest upon you, champion. This day, I name you Speaker of the Horde. 